Hello and welcome to Lynn TV, your local internet news station from Paphos. I'm Lucy Robson with the main news today. Former president of Cyprus, Tassos Papadopoulos, was a politician who served his homeland until his death. The words of President of the Republic, Dimitris Christofias, at the funeral of the former leader held at Hagia Sophia Church in Nicosia this morning. Attended by hundreds of mourners that included Cypriot political figures and the Greek premier, the service was officiated by Archbishop Chrysostomus II. Dassos Papadopoulos died of lung cancer on Friday at Nicosia General Hospital. He was 74. Paphos Mayor Savas Vergas has announced that a road in the town will be named after the late political figure. There is little Christmas cheer in Yeriskipu Central Square as an upgrade project that was scheduled to be finished this spring shows no sign of drawing to a close. Contractors told Lynn TV that a completion date is still not in sight. Famous for Lukumi, one shop owner said that she used to sell 50 boxes of Cypress Delights a week. Now she is lucky to sell two. Customers who use online banking services are being warned to ignore the latest of a string of email scams. A new spam email which appears to be from Likey Bank is circulating locally and asks for an update of personal banking details. Police News Now. Police are searching for two assailants who knifed a man in the toilet of a Paphos nightclub on Saturday night. The victim is now out of danger and is in stable condition at Paphos General Hospital. And finally, the chance to remember loved ones is being offered at a special service held in support of the St. Michael's Hospice Building Fund. At the Light Up a Life service, candles will be lit in memory of missed loved ones and those who are suffering from an illness. Described as uplifting, the ceremony will be followed by a mulled wine and mince pie reception. Light Up a Life is being held at Aya Giriaki Church in Gato Paphos on Wednesday, December 17th at 6pm. Candle reservations are seven euros. For more information, call the number on the screen. Well, that's all the news for today. Join us again tomorrow for a fresh roundup of local news.